Dear Jill, I never had the courage to reach out to you, and I'm not asking you to forgive me. I'm only asking you to listen to my story. Mom, please open the door. Our story. All the seas that fall, all the love that you have. <laughs> <laughs> I just can't even fucking spell the mark see. We always wanted to live a different life, and Ted is very happy here. Mom thinks I could pass. I want to go to college. Are you telling me you want us to spend thousands of dollars so that you can get a piece of paper that isn't worth a single dime? It's not just a piece of paper, Dad. I miss Colt, too. I'm trying to blame me because he ran away. You put him in a corner. We've worked really hard for this, and I don't want anything to change. You're still playing this game? It's not a game. We're well, running with the car. But that's a secret. This has to stop. You were the problem then. And you are the problem now. We wanted something different for ourselves and for our children. You're telling me I'm crazy for trying to protect that? This has nothing to do with protection. Stop the car! Mom! Woo! Uh -oh. Don't you ever touch me again! Go, go! They're coming! Get out! We gotta go! <laughs> truth to myself. I wanted it to disappear forever, together with me. I thought I would take responsibility and do something right for once. <laughs>